And there's Reggie White. White. And that's that hump move where he gets his right arm in and just pulls the guy in. Now watch the right arm there. You know, that'll happen a lot when you're blocking Reggie White. Reggie White is the best defensive lineman in the league. That seems to be pretty much unanimous. We didn't have a lot of respect to think that he was as good as he was. We didn't know. We finally made it to the field, and he was a wrecking ball. Sims is down. Reggie White just acquired. You know, his nickname is the Minister of Defense. I could see such awe in the face of the Giants because he was running over them. There was a frightening look in their face. I'll tell you, he's going to be a force. If he can play this well the first time he plays, we can go around midseason. He'll really be going. I don't think I've ever seen a defensive lineman like Reggie White. Six foot five, 285 pounds, and he can run. I mean, he's relentless. Reggie was a man among boys. There was nothing you could do to stop what he was doing. One of the best to ever suit up in the NFL. One man changed your offensive thinking for the entire game. Reggie White was the complete package. We're talking about the best defensive tackle, defensive end, whatever you want to call him, ever. You talk about natural strength, great leverage, Reggie White, number 92. White is the most gifted defensive lineman that Buddy Ryan's ever been around. And he's been around a lot of good ones in the years with the Bears. Reggie White, he's the preaching man that flips and turns like a beast. Third down now. Ten yards to go. Plunk it. Gonna go down. Reggie White getting a good push. Look at the push he got on Lawrence that time and pushed him right back into the quarterback. Still haven't decided the issue. Plunk it in trouble. There's Reggie White, number 92 there first. They didn't call it Minister of Defense for nothing. When he hit a quarterback, he on top of me, he had that look. Mm. And then he'd get up and say, you all right? He said, all right, we'll bless you then. He ain't going back to the Hubbard. <laughs> and he found a way to come bless you again. Redskins marching with the first and 10 of the 23. Williams will throw it. Nope, he won't either. It's stolen by Reggie White. You talk about momentum turning around. You come back, look, he's coming away from him. You see what happened is, as he was looking to the left, Williams was. White just came in and took the ball away from him. He's Reggie White is so strong. He takes number 74, who's not a small player, and just throws him back into the quarterback. What a play by Reggie White. That's Adams. Chased out of the pocket by Clark. Now by Reggie White. First and 10 Giants. Rutledge comes back to throw and is hammered by Reggie White. He was like he was in a cannon. Watch him like someone shot him out of there. It's a different team. And Chris Godfrey. Here's Rutledge back to throw. And down he goes, Reggie White again. Manuel in motion. Sims out of the spread formation. The Eagles on the blitz. They had Sims and he dropped the ball. And soon is to the left. And O'Brien back in the pocket. Under pressure, there's Reggie White. So it's second and goal from the five. O'Brien gives this time to Vic, who's tripped up in the backfield. And you see this guy not only sacks quarterbacks, but he plays the run well. The thing that probably stands up with Reggie White was his upper body strength. He would just take both hands, extend them, and then just look to see where the quarterback was and got rid of the offensive tackle the dominant defensive player in this league. You know, when I'm on the field, I want to do my best to intimidate the guy in front of me. Reggie was the guy that everybody feared. Let's get back to playing football like we started out the first four games, yes, right? But he was an absolute animal. You know, that'll happen a lot when you're blocking Reggie White. Great players do things. I mean, Reggie White will have tackles, and Reggie White will have sacks. And you always wonder, where's Reggie? What's he doing? That's really a mismatch where you got a tight end uh, going against an all-pro like Reggie White. First and 10 on the 18 of the Eagles. Everett is sacked by Reggie White. Who better to make that big play than probably the best lineman in the NFL? When you got to have a big play, you got to have your stars come up and make them. I tell you, Reggie White has played every yeah. snap as hard as you can play this football game. And you know, that's all you can ask. You look at the great defensive ends. You start out with a Deacon Jones, a Doug Atkins. Reggie took it to the next level.
Rice left, Taylor right. Montana. Oh! Reggie White gets him and grabs him at the two. 61, the center comes out. He gets through both of them and makes the sack of Montana. And that time, White, 92, just bull rushes it, engages Sapolo. Straight four-man rush. Got it! Here's Reggie White here. He's gonna come boom right up the middle. You see White right up the middle. He splits that thing. Now one sure he got some full step. Now watch what he does to Phil soon. Point. Reggie White came out of nowhere and buried Elway. That's where Reggie White likes to line up best. We talked about that when he can get a pass rush up the middle. And the, the good thing about lining up over the middle is once you break by him, you see, once he gets by Rafferty there, now you're right on the quarterback. We just cut the drumstick off, we'll give it to Reggie White. You have a shutout, you have to give it to a defensive guy. First down and 10. Hogaboom. Good night, Reggie White. Start again, Pitts goes right. Hogaboom, who's not very agile. Count how many bodies attempt to block White. What is considered by many the greatest pass rushing defensive end in the National Football League. Reggie White now lined up over the center. Doug Smith. And Reggie does the job. Of course, he did have this big ram offensive line. Very true. Fumble. Eagles have it. And the guy who's going to make things happen is Reggie White. Watch him. He's even doubled. He gets the rip. He gets the spin. Comes off the spin. Gets effort, the ball, and everything. Second and six from the 50-yard line for the Colts. Pressure on Trudeau. He doesn't feel it, and the ball is taken away by Reggie White. Esker in motion on third and 10 to 40. Trudeau with pressure coming up the middle. White's got him. That's Ray Donaldson, also one of the very best. Ray Donaldson three times in the Pro Bowl, but no match for Reggie White. Second down. Trudeau flush up the pocket. Reggie White in the grass. Steve Jordan starts in motion. Gannon takes his drop. He looks. He's hit. He sacked. The Eagles have him. Reggie. Ball came loose, and Reggie White came up with the football. Second and ten, Washington. Rutledge is sacked. Eagles get him. Reggie White. Back goes Humphreys. He has the ball deflected at the line of scrimmage, and it's caught by Reggie White. Down the far side of the field. Across the 20. Across the 15. Reggie White pulled out of bounds. Eagles show blitz and then drop out of it. Marino, Reggie White has it. Mark Dennis tries to throw on him. But you just can't go down and try and throw on somebody like Reggie White. He's going to dance around you and make a play. Reggie White is the best defensive lineman in the league. That seems to be pretty much unanimous. Monster arm would just hit the tackle and just the guy would just go two or three yards outside and let you make the sign. Lukowski with time, running out of it, and down he goes. And it's a trap play, and it goes nowhere. Reggie White's been all over the field already. Second and ten. Mikowski got hit. The ball came loose, and the Eagles have covered it. And here comes a pass, and Reggie White. He's going to fly right around Nate Newton. Watch him right here. Bootleg against the grain, but Reggie anticipating a trick play. Asias is already back at work. Third and 12 against this Philadelphia rush. And Asias feels the rush and goes down in the face of it. Reggie White in for the sack. Since 1985, more sacks than any other player in the league. Asias is passed, deflected, and intercepted. Reggie White. White, like a ball hawk, collapsed on the football. Irvins, Reggie White. Reggie White continues his streak as the only man in the NFL who has more than a sack for every game in which he has played. Rubbage, Reggie White. That is the third sack. He tries to throw the ball, it's intercepted. And running in for a touchdown is Reggie White. 
I'll tell you what, right now the difference in this ball game is Reggie White. Linebackers are better, defensive backs are better, other defensive linemen are better because of his presence. They can fool and rush you, but he can run around you. Right side of the screen goes around McElroy, through him. That's the ball out of the hand of Jay Schrader. Reggie White meets Marcus Allen. Hostetler wants to throw. He's hit, and this is Reggie White. He's rolling. He is being chased. Reggie got him by the legs. Gill ball retreats. He's hit. Reggie White has him inside the tenner. When Reggie White cranks up the bull rush, there's no one better. That's why Reggie White is an impact player, and that goes all the way back to the first play in the fourth quarter. Let's say Mayer in the end zone. That could be a safety. That is a safety. That's why they call him impact player. Reggie White took over this game. I was really impressed when I came up here the first time. I, Green Bay was the farthest thing from my mind. And with the direction the team is going, I think they, they have a total commitment to winning. Reggie White made it cool to play in Green Bay. I'm bringing the sack to the pack. L.A., Reggie White got him. And listen to this crowd. Here they come. And they got him. Reggie White is there. You have to take care of Reggie White. As you're coming, and Elway's going to be sacked in number 92. Reggie White has been relentless. Fourth down, 19 yards to go. Elway being flushed and sacked again by Reggie White. Back to throw, rushes on a blitz, and he's sacked on the play by Reggie White. Steps up, scrambles right, hit by Reggie White, and sacked. The 30-yard line, we try to offer whatever we can here in terms of full three. Oh, boy. A sack on Wilson. He is just going to bring pure power. That's on Kunar, look, boom, running right over. That's 300 pounds he threw out of the way. And then Willie Rope tries to get on it, but too late. Play action, and Wilson is going to be sacked by White. already five times today. buys him some time, and Hostel escapes for the moment, but Reggie White sacked him. A real good pass rusher is relentless. He never stops, and that's what you see there. He's been taken to the hospital for observation, so it'll be Vince Evans the rest of the way. And Evans gets the pass off, but hit at the 37 was Randy Jordan, and Leroy Butler picks up the loose ball. Third and 10. Miller in trouble, and there's Reggie White. Ball comes loose. Third down and eight. That nearly snapped over his head. White just throwing aside. And when you get Reggie White one-on-one -on -one with someone, more times than not, Reggie White's going to come out a winner as he did right there. Terry Allen is gobbled up by the guy we've been talking about, Reggie White. Chris Carter, the wide receiver, kind of thought about just for a second blocking Reggie White, then thought better of it. None of those runs have gone for touchdowns. Play action fake by Warren. Reggie White, he just bowled over the blocker. It's a mismatch when you have a wide receiver, Chris Carter, number 80, trying to block Reggie White. It's just not going to work. You'll watch him. He's working against a rookie, Larry Allen. Can't use Whoa. that left arm. Garrett back. Case. I think Jason Garrett has to know when you have Larry Allen over there trying to block against Reggie White that you better not float that way. You better not roll that way. It's going to be tough enough for Larry Allen. They better give him some help. But Reggie White put another one of those bull rush moves on Larry Allen. Now he just takes that right arm and just gets him going straight up in the air. 45 seconds remaining in the first quarter. A busted play, and Dave Craig is sacked back in the 20. Turn in motion. Sanders, there's the cutback. Watch out. Reggie White there to bring him down, and he saved a huge play. Also, he uses that bad arm. Aubrey Matthews in motion for the left. Craig, look out, pressure, steps away, in travel, down he goes. Reggie White, and you let Reggie White go one-on-one -on -one with one of the guards. He just bull rushes Sean Bowens right into Craig's face, doesn't give him any opportunity to find a receiver.
Miller on first and ten. Play action, and he is taken down. Miller is sacked by Reggie White, the all-time leader. Well, how many guys offensively can you afford to put on a guy like Reggie White? This time, Carter, the lone setback, and back to throw Eric Kramer. Kramer steps up under the pressure. No, he fumbles no, the football. It's no. torn away from behind. Looks like Green Bay football. Moves to his right. Aikman gives again to him and Smith. That is a great tackle for a big man. Here's Aikman. And that makes Reggie have his 150th sack. The all-time leading sacker. Evans in motion. Moon loses his footing and now his sack. And that's Reggie White. Put the pressure on Moon and Jones picks it up for the fumble recovery. Good protection is Zion now in trouble. Wow. Gets away somehow, but not a second time. Now he's in the third down package. Three wide receivers. Urban was in the slot. Eight minutes down by Reggie White. I told you Reggie White was fired up. Watch him right here. Here he is against Eric Williams. He just beats him. He beats Eric with his push. Then he pushes him and then right around him. He wants to win so badly. He is the guy who came to Green Bay to try to take him back to the Super Bowl. Yeah, here's it. I mean, anytime third and long, Reggie knows that it's going to be a pass and he's just going to take off. You know, he's got the perfect combination of strength. Look at the way he just walks Riesenberg back into the quarterback. 12 years, never won a championship of any kind in his entire career. There's Bledsoe. Down he goes. And there's Reggie White. White. And that's that hump move. Then he's going to come to the inside. Now watch the right arm there. See him get the right arm, and he just throws Max Lane to the side. Reggie's coming again. And Reggie White. Reggie White's going to take over this game right now. It's going to just be one Packer legacy. And Reggie again. His third sack of the day. And Reggie White deserves a championship. Yes, he does. The Vince Lombardi Trophy is coming home. So they're not worried about Tyrone Williams as far as the cover goes. Here's Detmer back to throw, and here comes the rush by Reggie White around the corner. On first down from the 31, Mitchell trying to get away. Reggie White gets the ball. <laughs> Just when you say he's a non-factor, guess who's a factor? Gilbert, back to throw it. Look out, Reggie White. Wide receiver, the Packers take the blitz. Here comes Reggie White. You know, you say, oh, Reggie, well, he's getting a little bit older. He waits, waits, waits for his moment, and then explodes. You can give me Reggie White on my team any day of the week. The man has got character, and he knows how to play the game. I'll tell you something, Reggie White's not the same. He's better than 80% of the players in the league. And one of the best that's ever played his position. Young is hit. And the Packers pick it up. Remember at the end of the Super Bowl last year, it was Reggie White, and he does things like this. He's going against Kirk Strafford, and you think that Reggie White can't be Reggie White, but Reggie White can still raise some havoc on you. The tight end split to the left out of the slot, and Dilfer loses the ball. It's a fumble. Gets the ball slapped right out of his hand. Just a bull rush. Just pure power. Third down and six. Dilfer is sacked. Reggie White is putting on a clinic to Jason Odom today. Batch under pressure, Reggie White had him around the ankles. He just takes Tharp and throws him away. Batch under pressure, and down he goes, Reggie White. He's just amazing in his 14th year. First 15 of each play, four wide receivers for Young. And again, he's taken down, this time by Reggie White. Young's back again. And he's tipped up. And they started going after it from the get-go. There's Steve Young and here's Reggie White. There's that club move. He got clubbed on that last play by Reggie White. 
And a play fake, here they come, and Bentner goes down. And Reggie White with his 15th sack of this season. Down to the 14-yard line on first down. Byron feeling the heat, and there's the first sack of the season for the Carolina Panthers, and the first one for Reggie White in Carolina Blue. Well, we saw, we saw that Scott Craddock trying to cut Reggie White. Well, Reggie still has that athletic ability just to jump over. Third and 11, Chandler. He's dropped by Reggie White. Blitz coming, and they got Trent Green again. For Reggie White, career sack 197. He was special. Reggie took him to school. In the critical moments, he can change the nature of the game. And he did exactly that. One of the greatest players of all time.